last summer me and tennessee eagle 3 had a conversation about showbiz pizza place and that's today's videos guys what happened to showbiz pizza place i'm going to tell you the story what happened to showbiz pizza place so let's begin the story begins in 1977 when atari would open up their own brand place for video games known as chuck e cheese pizza time theater that was the original name guys then Atari hired Bob Brock to open up millions of Chuck E. Cheese. Little did Bob Brock know he would open up an own place known as Showbiz Pizza Place. Then Bob Brock hired Aaron Fector to be with the Chuck E. Cheese community. Then Aaron Fector created their own demo version of the Rock of Fire Explosion called the Wolf Pack 5. In the 1980s, Chuck E. Cheese actually sued Showbiz Pizza for $50 million. In 1984, Chuck E. Cheese's wasn't doing too well. Then in the 1990s, Showbiz Pizza actually sued Chuck E. Cheese for $50 million. What did I just say? Chuck E. Cheese actually sued Showbiz Pizza for $50 million. Crossover. So when the company filed, they would turn all restaurant as Chuck E. Cheese. That's not all. Here's the great part of the video. There is still one location left, everyone. The show they have is mostly broken down. Anyway, guys, I'm not going to give free shout out today in this video. Um, the reason why I'm getting tired right now, and I'll do it in the next video, guys. So anyway, guys, if you want to make my videos more awesome, like the video, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell when I upload a new video to Sean Castell and Friends, and comment down below and tell me you subscribe. Okay, guys, I'll see you on Friday. Goodbye.